come and have a lamp. <laughs> No way! Yes, we're going to sing when you're finished. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Andy. Happy birthday to you. Absolutely thrilled and delighted that you all could be here this evening. It's not so much about the birthday as about, I feel, about getting friends, relations together and having a great evening in their company because life is short and it's fantastic to have these occasions. If there's one thing I've been saying around tonight that I hate about them is that in the blink of an eye, they're kind of over and you don't get enough time to go individually to all your friends and just express how nice it is to spend time in their company and have a great, happy occasion. There are people here from <clears throat> so many strands in my life Upstairs <laughs> from my direct family sitting here to my wider family to neighbours. In fact, we're not neighbours, we're friends. All of our neighbours who are here tonight are our very best friends. Um, people who I've worked with over the years in the music profession and still working in it. Thanks to God, we haven't been found out yet, lads, we're close now, but uh, Desmore came in today and he said, uh, you've actually progressed now from the stalls and the circle up to the grand circle. He said, and after that, there's only the gods. So hopefully we won't quite get there for, for another point. Again, things that strike me, uh, I'm kind of lucky. I'm, I'm a bit of a cuckoo when it comes to golf clubs in that my good friend Jerry Lloyd who actually by the way I have to tell you flew back yesterday from Spain to be here tonight and then told me that it cost him 300 weeks to do that and when I, was I going to give it back to him but seriously 10 years ago I remember we had a, a similar event in Scary's Golf Club, Jerry's a member there, and he facilitated it. So I'm a cuckoo when it comes to the golf clubs. I'm not a member in any of these clubs, but I happen to know a few people who can maybe kind of put it a little bit right or whatever. So we were in Scary's 10 years ago. And at that stage, can I tell you that if somebody said to me on that night, do you know that in the next 10 years, you are going to take up cycling? You're going to ride your bike to Paris? You're going to ride your bike to Berlin, and you're going to keep on riding your bike. I would have said, you're absolutely joking. Never going to happen. It couldn't possibly happen. And yet, all of those things <clears throat> have happened in the last 10 years. And I'd like to just thank my cycling buddies who are here tonight. And it has been a fantastic thing for me to get 
so involved with you guys or whatever and it's all basically a little bit of a, a comp competitiveness or whatever between us in our latter years but basically it's fun and we enjoy the crack with each other so I'm delighted that you guys are here yeah. and you girls are here with them it's always good to have the couples come to these another thing that happened in this 10 years that I again wouldn't have said would have happened before was one day I got a phone call from a girl saying look we have a little choir and we're kind of out on the ocean and we don't have somebody to kind of steer the boat or whatever the whatever the phrase that one might use or whatever and that was which became sensation and uh, it's fantastic to have 24 of the choir here tonight 22 um, and, and we really enjoy we have our Monday night rehearsals and we do a couple of gigs from time to time or whatever but it's fantastic and I can tell you guys you know to have the 24 good looking women sitting at a table at your birthday party is not a bad move at all you know a lot of the cyclists will be saying well, fair play can we get it? <laughs> another little strand that happened in the, the last couple of years uh, again was uh, some work that I've done with the the concert orchestra and that evolved a group of singers called the celebration singers and about five or six of them are here tonight and they're spot on they're great singers and delighted to, that they're part of our night and, uh, and anybody else who, who i haven't named it's not because like you are the less or the more you're all equally important in my life in our lives uh, I'd especially like to pay tribute to my two fantastic daughters, oh, Sheena Rossi. and Kate. <laughs> Sheena made the actual, the, 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 the Chalk chalkboards, is that what, what do you call them? Blackboards, is it the blackboards that were outside with the actual info about 1955. She also made the cake, <laughs> which again is, a fantastic uh, uh, story or whatever in itself. Kate, the two girls are just the light of our lives and now that they have moved out, <laughs> life has got so much better for us and for them. Okay. I hope. And last but certainly not least, I'd just like to thank my fantastic wife Clodagh. Who, as I always been, who actually said, for instance, let's say, when I took up a little bit of cycling, she produced an ad in the paper, which was for Irish Hospice Foundation, saying, cycle to Paris. She said, you're going to do that. I said, no, I'm not. I couldn't possibly even think about doing that. You are going to do that. And I did that. And I mean, she, she knows me so well and knows what I can, what I can't, and what's good and what's bad, that she is absolutely the apple of my eye. And I'm absolutely 100% at the age of 60, happy and lucky in my life. So thank you all and enjoy the rest of the evening. And I'm delighted that, again, that you were able to be here. Thank you.
all the way back from Marbella today to be with us here tonight. I forgot to mention that Joanna traveled and Eric traveled from England today, literally by surprise over here tonight. My niece and niece and nephew in law. And also Kevin, standing in front of me here, traveled from Lanzarote today. I think that kind of puts you in your place a bit in terms of distance, cost. How's your tie, Jerry? <laughs> I hope it's better than Kevin's. Kevin has been in Lanzarote for the last four months. Now you wouldn't think that, would you? Look at him. <laughs> anyway, Kevin, we'll, we'll finish up the, the spot for the, the celebration singers with Kevin doing a little Rod Stewart impersonation. Three, three numbers. Enjoy!
Gareth, sorry about that. We spun that on you. And Karen, that was your dad there when we spun that on you. Right? Great, thanks very much. We're going to go back in a little while to a bit of dancing and having a good time and fun. But before that, there's a group here of singers who I can't leave any longer. 24, 22, gorgeous, gorgeous ladies who are sing station, right? And who keep me on a Monday night.
day No matter what you say You know it happens all the time Love will never do What you want to do Just let this crazy love be mine
college or like I had so. So. She is. How are you feeling, Ben? I'm alright. I'm doing okay. So this is what I'm nice for. Like, how do you feel? Like, oh, like, 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 she's, like, she's she's gone. Yes. Okay. She's on UK time. <laughs> <laughs> Not paddy time. <laughs> no, it's really nice. No, I wouldn't taste like grass. No, it's really nice. Grass or ass? <laughs> Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I do. I have a wolf back here. Hey, you jungle. Oh, it's Jesus. I've read a few. It's my favourite now. It's the one I love now.
his shoes. What are you doing? Graham. What are you doing? Hi. Huh? What are you doing? I'm fixing my ears. Hey, you want to have a cigarette? Yes. What are you going to sit there for?